Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with the environmental engineering in the topic of biological oxygen demand. So the problem is the BOD of CVH incubated for one day at 30 degrees Celsius has been found to be 110 milligram per liter. What will be the 5 day 20 degree Celsius BOD assume K1 equal to 0 0.1 at 20 degree Celsius. Okay. So, uh, if the water sample is, uh, wastewater sample is incubated one day in the 30 degree Celsius. So, the BOD found is 110 milligram per liter. So, the same sample is will be in, uh, incubated in 5 days at 20 degree Celsius. What is the BOD? So, this is the question. So, we have to understand first uh, these things. So, now the given values. So, given y 1 day at 30 degree Celsius. Okay. So, 30 degree Celsius is given that is 110 milligram per liter. So, then Kd value is given. So, Kd at 20 degree Celsius is given that is 0 0.1. Okay. So, now we have to find out the Kd value at 30 degree Celsius. Okay. So, 20 degree Celsius the Kd value is given. So, now uh, we have to find out the Kd value at 30 degree Celsius. Okay. So, now we can take Kd at temperature equal to, so Kd 20 degrees Celsius into 1.047 power T minus 20. Okay. So, now we can substitute the Kd 20 values 0 0.1 into 1.047 power 30 minus 20. Okay. So, now we got the value of 0.158 okay so this is the value that is the kd at 30 degree celsius value okay so now we can find out the uh, l value that is ultimate ultimate bod the, using the formula yt equal to l into 1 minus 10 power minus kd into t so now we know at 30 degree celsius y1 so, one day BOD is uh, BOD at 30 degree Celsius we know. So, now we can using this formula. So, Y one day 30 degree Celsius equal to the formula will be L into 1 minus 10 power minus KD into T. Okay. So, now we can substitute. Uh, so, the Y 1 power 30 is uh, sorry 30 degree Celsius is 110 equal to L we have to find out 1 minus 10 power minus KD at 30 degree Celsius. So, minus KD at 30 degree Celsius we found out 0 0.198. So, minus 0 0.158 into T value is 1 day. Okay. So, now solving this we got the only unknown we got the value of L value. So, that is ultimate BOD. So, L equal to 361.8 milligram per liter. Okay. So, this is the ultimate BOD we got uh, from the equation. Okay. So, same sample is tested. So, the ultimate BOD is uh, same in uh, both cases. So, now we can take 5 day BOD at 20 degree Celsius. Okay. So, now we can substitute the same formula L into 1 minus 10 power minus KD at 20 degree Celsius into time. Okay. So, now we can substitute y uh, 520 equal to L values 361.8 into 1 minus 10 power minus Kd value. So, the Kd value is uh, uh, Kd at 20 degree Celsius that is given that is 0 0.1 into T is 5 days BOD. So, that is 5. Okay. So, solving this we got the value of y 5 days at 20 degree Celsius equal to 247.4 milligram per liter. Okay, so this is the BOD they are asking in the question. So that is 5 days BOD at 20 degree Celsius. Okay, they are giving the sewage is incubated in one day at 30 degree Celsius. The uh, BOD we received is uh, 110 milligram per liter. Okay, so same soil, so same water is tested in uh, 5 days BOD. So same water is uh, incubated in 5 days. Uh, in, in 20 degree Celsius, what is the BOD? So, that is a 247.4 milligram per liter is the BOD. Okay. So, this is the method we can solve the problem. Again, we will see next video. Thank you.